Hey, what's up? And welcome to another training with coffee. You know, it's been a while, but now I have a subject to talk about. So uh, it's something uh, I didn't research it. It's like everyone's talking about it. It's big news. It's something shocking. And my beer doesn't show it. It's like uh, a day's work with a mask. That's the problem. Anyway. But first, you know what? I need coffee. So I will go get my coffee. I'm going to find a place and we're going to do it outside. Okay? So let's go get the coffee. Huh? Let's go. Hey, and welcome to another training with coffee. And today we're going to talk about Alec Baldwin fatally shooting. I cannot say killing, but fatally shooting someone and also injured someone else during a movie set. So let's start with coffee. Mmm. And this is, I don't know, yeah, it says organic coffee. Uh, organic uh, fair trade coffee. Did you guys know that ANW in Canada, they have organic fair trade coffee? Uh, could be important. Whatever. Not whatever. But let's go back to the subject. So, Mr. Baldwin shooting someone. It's very bad. Because um, I know he didn't want to do it and he was shocked and then why someone gave me a, a hot gun that's what he, he said out loud and for me it's like I don't know why it's not the first time it happened it happened when uh, they were shooting the movie uh, The Crow the main actor died and it's like it's not it's not did someone did it on purpose? Put a live round between fake ball, uh, fake uh, bullets, or it's like a honestly mistake. Like maybe you won't like it, what I think. But what I think is like in 2021, we should have like technology to do stuff, like look alike real guns to have like something on it says it's not a gun. Rubber bullets, shoots like, sounds like a real one, shoots like a real one, but it's fake bullets, blank bullets, rubber bullets, never, never like a live bullet. Like it would be impossible to find a bullet that would fit this kind of gun. Why did you do that? You should do that for uh, movies. It's, like, it's, it's crazy. Now, the police on it, like investigation, everything. Now they're gonna ask that did Alec Baldwin intentionally wanted to kill the people putting the bullets in the gun? Did they have a plan? What is it like on purpose and everything? It's like it's everything like this. I don't I don't I cannot believe that in twenty twenty one we cannot have a gun that looks like a real gun, impossible to put real bullets in it. And be safe. Like, be safe. It's like, he's shocked. I don't blame him. Like, he, he never shoot a gun. Like, maybe it's the first time he, he was, like, holding a gun in his life. And me, I hold a gun, like, once in my life. Just one. And it was empty. So, I can imagine the shock of him. Because I remember... On, in the news says it was the first time he was holding a gun and then someone put a live bullet like a real bullet inside I don't know
What do you guys think? I don't know. Did we should invent a gun for this? Is there a company who does that already? Huh? We should search. Anyway, that's that's it. It's short, sweet. Bottom line. I, I hope they they find like someone is responsible for putting the live bullet inside. I think he will never work in movies again. And I think we should like in 2021 to have guns impossible to be real bullets inside. So that's it. Okay. If you have something trending and you want me to have coffee and talk about it, comment below. Huh? You know, if you're like me and you like your coffee black, just say what I say. I take like my coffee like my toenails. Black.